Hello, today we have some great tips for you for the month of September. Uh, first thing we want to start with is sealing up your house for the winter. Uh, some of you probably have already had infestations of the field crickets that seem to be taking over Oklahoma, but there will be other insects tar starting to move into our homes as well, seeking shelter. So now is a good time to inspect your home, watch for the, look for those cracks and crevices that the insects might be able to get into and seal those up. Now, this is also a good time to watch the, for the specials in the nurseries and garden centers as the fall is probably the best time to plant most of our ornamentals. It's also a good time to start your cool season annuals uh, such as uh, pansies, uh, ornamental kale and cabbage. They'll be found in the nurseries pretty soon, probably towards the latter part of September. Um, and so you can plant those from September on into October. It's also a good time to continue to plant some of your cool season vegetables like spinach, lettuce, radish, rutabagas uh, for a fall crop. And then if you're maintaining tropical house plants outdoors on your patios or, or decks, now would be a good time to acclimate those to go inside by moving them into shady areas to help acclimate to those lower light levels. For turf areas, the first of September is your last opportunity to fertilize your warm season grasses. And this should be completed by the, by the middle of September. And also remember that if you're going to fertilize, there should be adequate soil moisture available or irrigation to water that fertilizer in. Never apply fertilizer to a water-stressed plant. Now towards the latter part of September, our winter broadleaf weeds such as dandelions will start to pop up. And you can control those with a 2,4-D type of herbicide. Now if pre-emergence control of winter annuals such as chickweed, henbit, and annual bluegrass are needed, uh, that should also be completed by about the second, uh, second week of September. Now remember, if you're going to seed an area or overseed an area, then you don't want to be using pre-emergence at that time. And then finally, if you're going to seed a new or overseed a cool season grass, such as uh, Kentucky bluegrass, tall fescue, or ryegrass, that should be done uh, between the middle to the latter part of September, as the fall is the best time to establish a cool season turf grass.